this blue hair is working it for me, but I feel so cramped in with these. Oh, we were on lockdown. Are we not on lockdown? I've been here the whole time. The whole time. You just have to pull the camera out. Hey everybody, it's me, Wilma Fingerdo, and I am here to review a Drag Race Season 14, the never-ending season's finale, finally, with my drag daughter, the one I like. <laughs> Let's put up with, is she rich? Wilma, be in a box fight. How are you, darling? Hi, everyone. I'm great, Wilma. How are you? I am delicious. You look fantastic. You I woke up looking like this. Well, I am not going to thank anybody for anything. I'm not going to talk about anything. No, like, no, Vito. Like how you should... Like how you should subscribe to my channel or give it a thumbs up or check out the links to help support down in the uh, the description box. But I'm not doing any of that. We're just going to get to it. We're going to jump right in. All right. Jorge Drinky. Ooh. Ooh, hi. Oh, thank you, Jorge. Mm. You really? Ooh, double, double. Ooh, thank you, Jorge. Yeah. Wave to the camera, Jorge. People don't believe you're existing. There you go. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers Mama. This is the pink pucker. You haven't had one yet. Mm, no, I Tequila haven't. and pink lemon. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. oh, it's delicious. If that doesn't keep you honest, <laughs> nothing will. All right. So, 16 episodes when it was all said and done. 16 long episodes. Tedious, to... non-eliminating episodes. So people just hung around, people got <laughs> sent home, and then came back immediately. No kidding, because we started yeah. off saying goodbye to Orion's story. Bye. And then we said goodbye to Diabetti. And then they came back. And that was the theme for the entire season. The theme for the entire the season come back was no kids. one goes home. Yeah. One of the things that was great about this finale is we have not had a live finale in two years. It felt so good. It yeah. felt so yeah. good. So we had, of course, our parade of queens. Parade of queens, yeah, starting yeah. off with... June Jambalaya. God, she looked gorgeous. It didn't really feel Vegas for me. No, it, it was more like, like more like a high roller. It felt like a housewife. Like if you were like in a... Monaco, if you were if you were Melissa McCarthy in Spy, you'd wear that. It felt like someone just standing next to someone that was gambling. Yes, yes, and uh, wife of. Okay. Just it just didn't feel like what was the what was the category? Viva Viva Drag Vegas or whatever. Something like, it was Diva, vague, like but... yeah, Vegas girls, showgirls. It just, just felt less Vegas than yeah. it could have been. Yeah, but she's still stunning. Alyssa Hunter was next. That's right. What did you think of her? Throwing little... money around. Well, her. finally, she couldn't rely on that money gun in her lip sync, so she brought. Fans always work. They rely on no power whatsoever. No power whatsoever. Just... Mm -hmm. I thought it was, I thought it was cute. I thought it was more Vegasy than June. Yes, but, it was... but I, I was confused by it. all the line work on it. It looked like a big spider web, but I I, I don't know if that's what she was going for. Not that she didn't look stunning. Her wig was gorgeous. You're not a fan of those crusted wigs. I've... Admit it. I'm growing Admit tired it. of them already. Yeah. I know, as someone who wears the same wig all the time, I'm not tired of this one. It's no, gorgeous. how could you? How could you gorgeous. look at it? But, it, you know, it's one of those things that when you when you see it occasionally, you're like, ooh. And yeah. then when you see everyone do it... Overdone. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. But, overdone or not, she looked good. Next up, Cornbread. Oh, the Cornbread. Snack I loved her uh, Beauty and the Beast uh, look. That was, I thought that was just stunning. I don't understand why, except that that's, is that a show in Vegas? No, I don't think they've ever had no, it. No, it no, like, no. I was, I was confused by it, because yeah. I'm like, this doesn't feel like Vegas either, unless, this, you know, one of Siegfried and Roy's yeah. lesser known, yeah. fatter tigers. I, I still know. was impressed by it. As far as following the category, no. I was, I was confused. I didn't realize there was a category until halfway through. Neither did when I. When all of a sudden everyone started looking the same, I was like, oh, is there a category? Yeah. And then, all the costumes looked better because Ryan's story came out. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I have to say, I loved her Chinese dragon. Well, I've never seen a pink Chinese mirror's dragon. I thought it was like dragon, a puppet boa, but... and I immediately was like... Next down that runway was Fatty Morphosis. Jesus, her face. Oh so my god, nice. the reunion. This? Yeah. Holy crap. That's called learning how to blend. Serving some Lady Elvis. She looked great. She looked great. I love the wig. I love the wig. The wig. Yeah. yeah. I I like it was was it evil? Was it, evil? It, was, it was Elvis kissing the wig for sure, but it was uh, I, I liked it. But it was still like it, there was like a level of costume store quality to yeah. it. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like I thought her face was the best thing about her face was gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah, gorgeous. She really, 
She beats a good mug. She beats a good mug, yes, that she girl. Does. Next down the runway in a gold fantasy. Carry Colby. Holy crap. Holy crap. She is one of the most beautiful women I think I've ever seen walking around. I love Do you know the what I mean? little infinity gauntlet. Yeah, and apparently, uh, it, one stone for each of the four trans people that came out on Drag Race. That's fun. Yeah, so it was the most trastastic season in Drag Race history. One more trans person and, and then half everyone's of everyone could have been gone. Yeah, yeah. The non-trans people. Yeah, bye-bye for you. You've had it too good for too You've long. You've had it too good for too long. Suck on this, sisters. <laughs> <laughs> She's such a polite girl. I can't imagine her saying that. I don't know. I don't know how she she called me to say, "Can you just put it on my voice machine?" Sure. Second like, oh, this, this <laughs> Next down the runway, Jasmine Kennedy's wig, closely followed by oh, Jasmine, Jasmine Kennedy. Kennedy, and followed up by now weird dress. Weird dress. Yeah, the dress oh, is weird. I love the wig. The wig. Oh mm. my god. However, eight wow. wigs. Wow. There were there. I want to know who made that wig because that was perfection. I and it, live in that wig. It was so balanced on her too, and she carried it. Yeah, she looked. She looked gorgeous. She's so gorgeous. It's distracted she by from her say rear shoulder. A word. It was the best she's ever been on camera. It's fantastic. <laughs> I didn't mind the dress, but I wish it the one side that was low, I wish both sides had been like that, because this side looked like nineteen eighties award show. Do you yeah. know what I mean? And this side was more interesting. It's still done result. It's lesser. Result. Yeah, yeah. Almost didn't get a finger near that one, I'm just gonna say. Just gonna say. Just gonna what? Say. Just How many finger that just for the wig? It's the wig that saved it. Let's just be honest. Saved it. Next down the runway in a fabulous show pony outfit, Deja Sky. She was uh, paying homage to Miss Congeniality 2. It's cute. I really liked Deja's outfit until our next queen, Georges, came down the yes. runway showing how you could do it. It was yeah. beautiful. Because Deja looked okay. Deja looked fine, yeah. But, wow, the only problem I had with Georges's outfit was that, that with the dark hair underneath, the, the rhinestone wig looked like a helmet. Oh, it looked like it, it looked, well, looked like it was bobbling a bit. I would have liked to have seen that look without a wig. I don't know if maybe she wore the wig because it was too big. But, uh, oh, I loved it. I loved it. She didn't ask. She didn't call. Silvery, it was sparkly. Yeah. yeah, she was stunning. It was very distracting. Yeah, and then we had our top five. First down the runway, Angeria. Gorgeous. Oh my Stop god. It. Oh my god! Peacock of vision. She brought her own wall, her own photo wall. Like, it if you want to get somebody out of a photo, wear that outfit. You just turn, <laughs> boom, gone. My suit back off. She looked gorgeous. She looked gorgeous. And the way she was moving, that was a heavy, you know, that. That was 8,000 pounds. But it didn't, like, tip over no, on the top of her. I wonder I if, because she had the straps there, I wonder if also the wings, because with a lot of uh, festival costumes, they have wheels. And they take up some yeah. of the weight by actually resting on the ground. But I looked for that, and I didn't, I didn't see it. So either they were masterfully hidden, or Jerry's a lot stronger than she is. Well, she has, she's been in the gym, yeah. She just looked like she was having a time of her life. It was, it, they there. were there for her. What finale? What finale? Oh, this old thing. <laughs> Next down the runway, yes. in a slightly pale imitation of what Jerry had just been yeah, wearing. Yeah, yeah, it was, Bosco. wasn't it? Yeah. It, was kind of it like went from bird of paradise yeah. to a blue lizard. Yeah, just lots of horns. Yeah. Version. And wings. We were not sure if they'll sustain flight, but they're there. Those are just gliding wings. Yeah, just for short distances. Yeah. Getting from one award show yeah, to another. Flying one. squirrel wings. She looked good. She looked good. Yeah, she did. So, next down the runway, looking stunning, diabetic. Oh my god. Oh my god. For, for the evil queen of the season, or at least the mean <laughs> girl. Wow. I, I would let her call me names in that outfit. Oh, I would, I would, I would. No, no not at all. No, 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 I, would, I would still picture her. I would still be like, you know what? You look gorgeous. Shut your damn mouth. Shut your mouth, you beautiful creature. <laughs> Shut your stupid little, pretty little, gorgeous. Look how gorgeous you are, you yeah. horrible, horrible woman. Yeah. <laughs> stunning, you mean girl. Look how stunning you are, you little meanie. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I, can't, I, I can't deny. She looked amazing. Yeah, she really did. Um, and then, of course, we had Lady Camden trotting yeah. out her show pony. Show pony. Visions. Borrowed a little carriage from Buckingham I didn't, Palace. I didn't like this outfit. You didn't like it? No, it was cute. It was interesting, but... It, it, it just bothered Scare me that the voices. wheels were going sideways. That's the first thing. The wheels were going sideways, and she was walking towards us. I get it looked better. 
Um, and until she took the horse head off, I didn't like it. And then she took it, and then I liked it. With the, the bit I love, a yeah, bit I love. That's the bit. fine. But the wheels on the on the carriage bothered me, and I'm I'm just that's that's all. It's trivial. It's trivial. But uh, she looked gorgeous. She did once she took the head, the face off. You're happy. That was the, I, I just you know I've heard of puppy play, but horsey play, carousel horsey play. And then the last queen down the runway. Last but not least. She's oh, just a will pill. It's a will pill. Just, you won't even it's have to mash it into peanut butter. You won't. I was confused by this outfit. Yeah, I didn't know what it was either. I didn't understand it. When I don't understand things, I get angry. I threw yeah. something. Yeah. I yeah. did. Did you? Yeah. I did. Because the like sword that. arm, the sword. Someone wanted to look like a scissor. Look like a scissor. Uh, yeah, there was something. Yeah. And then and the one thing I liked about this was that cut out at her hip. It was just a sexy place to put no fabric. Especially on Willow. She has great legs and hips, so. So that was, that was, but yeah, I love the color of it. That was the one thing I loved about it. It was like, oh, finally some color coming down the road. Because I felt everything was so glittery and pale. Yeah. And Rue made a big entrance on her chocolate bar fan. Mm. Send it from the heavens on a backdrop of chocolate. We were surprised uh, by Michelle Visage and a bunch of half-naked pit crew dancers. Yes, I was uh, surprised by how bad Michelle's twerking was. She twerks perfectly for a woman of her age. It's true, it's true. Yeah, she was, you know that her daughters are at home. Like, oh, what are you doing? Stop her. Someone stop her! <laughs> As it should be. But um, but she presented Rue with the key up to the city. There's no official person there. Like It just felt like they had stamped some metal, take it, took it to the engravers, and we're going to do this. And, and I feel like the mayor uh, of Vegas or somebody, the city council is all sitting at home like, What's going on? Yeah. What's happening? Should we send someone to help? Bill, uh, did you approve this? What's what going on? Drag queens. <laughs> are there tits? I'm not going. <laughs> what tip? No. The thing I loved the most about this uh, finale was because there were five queens, we got five performances. And the last few, they were doing the wheel, spinning the wheel, and. It was nice seeing everyone on their own. It yes. Was nice, like, and with an original song, with yeah. a, 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 or at least a, a song catered to them. And uh, we started off with Angeria, and I liked her song. It was fun was and great, but her costume was a bit boring, and I thought that the dancers were like Well, as soon as busy. the dancers took their shirts off, I completely yeah. stopped watching Angeria. Yeah. Oh, was Angeria still on stage? I just watched the dancers, because they were delightful. Oh, oh, she looked yeah, fine. Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was fine. It, was good. It, it just didn't... It wasn't great. It wasn't great. That's it was all. good. Yeah. Wasn't great. Yeah. Would like I have regretted buying a ticket to that show? Not at all. Yeah. But I also wasn't calling people on my cell phone saying, You're missing the best show! Yeah. Right after her, it was Bosco. And first of all, the way it started with the, that headpiece with the feathers, and then she ran her hands and it just opened up like a fan. Of so pretty. And, so pretty. Then, and then her in that black wig. I didn't recognize her. No! No! With the white contacts, and she's yeah. it was the most clothing she's ever worn. It confused me. Yeah, I didn't realize who it was. No. I was like, wait a minute, who's like this? No, she looked, she looked good. She looked good. And her song was all right. I don't remember really much um, her song lyric was, wise. Her song was nice. The dancers were good. Floating the dancers down. were all in black, the so they didn't distract. Bright. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. And then they all closed around her, and oh. literally a second or two later, it, was, it wasn't immediate, but it yeah. was pretty quick. She is in a... Clearly, like, whatever was there was She's terrible. The monster. But you didn't see... Somebody had, had it all bunched up under them, but you, it was just... Smooth transition. It's a nice way. transition. Yeah. What, but, did you, what did you think? I didn't mind it, but I wish the whole thing had been made out of rhinestones or something. Just it to make it so punch out. Yeah, like rhinestone lips. Those monster teeth with rhinestone lips would have been gorgeous. Rhinestone lips rhinestone or just teeth. something to make the teeth shiny and wet and creepy and, and just maybe some blood. Like just something like just to drag it up, it just felt a little muted. It did. You know? It was muted. That's exactly it. Also, because it was a corset, and then the boots were so it was the same thing. There was a lot of it. Yeah. Right after that, we had Betty. A confusing beginning. I don't know why you would start so far back peeking through some cobwebs. Well, I think she was a spider. I think that's yeah. what her hairdo was. Was a spider. But, but then why really, the feathers? You couldn't really see her face. No. Like, Who is that? And I didn't. Going I on? couldn't tell you one thing about her song. I have to say, I. I it, as beautiful as she looked, I was so disappointed in the number because I felt like, oh yeah, she's not going. Yeah. The the fit was more the performance of the yeah. song. I yeah. love the big billowy abdomen that she started with. Well, that whole thing, the song f- f- was called Fight or something or other. 
And then she was recreating Christina Aguilera's fighter with that big abdomen thing blowing, and and then and then revealing to the feathers and everything. It was yeah, just, the little feather. I think it was weird. Fun. It was gorgeous. I, I lost her face though. Yeah, I hate wigs that come stuff. across a face. I don't For, like. On lip sync, I need to like even if the yeah. only thing I can see on is your, your face mouth. is your mouth. Yeah. That is all I need to see for your lip sync. But I Absolutely. Can see it. Then, of course, we had Lady Camden. Lady oh. Camden. She came out in a classic dancery outfit. I liked her number. Really, yeah. I, I liked how kind of simple her the lyrics performance were. performance was better. Her performance yeah. was good. The reveal outfit, again, was a little... It was lackluster oh, because she spun out of that dress into a onesie. Yeah. We're in Nigeria. It's like, did you go to the same store? But the energy she brought to it, I felt it filled. I yeah. love the, I love the finale. The I, wig change I thought was she fun. Used the dancers, yeah. yeah, beautifully. Yeah. I was, yeah. yeah, yeah. As soon as, as soon as Gavin was was done, I was like, okay, that's that's well one done. of the, yeah, she's that's going to be one of the two. Yeah. It's got to be one of the two. And then the will wisp pill came out. Oh, pill. And first of all, that whole thing with the pill was like a big, huge baby fade, like with the ruffles. It's all like around. she won herself or something. Or like something. She, it was weird, a, and, and that color was odd. Like a diarrhea colored ribbon. Like congratulations, you're eighty seventh place. <laughs> yeah, that's what color yeah. that is. Yeah, and then her chorus happened very quickly. <laughs> I hate people. As soon as I saw the name of the song, yeah. I knew I was gonna like yeah. it. I knew yeah. I was gonna like yeah. it. The lyrics made sense. It was it cute. Was the catchy. graphics it was behind cute. her were fabulous. It was hel- oh, her fantastic. Her delivery and performance was great. And then she whipped off the face or the face shield, and there were two other <laughs> faces there. And then at the end, there was a third phase. Ooh, Michelle. So funny. So, so funny. And, yeah, I knew she was going through. Like, there was no question. It was Lady no question. Camden and Willow. But then I wanted it to be Lady Camden and Willow. No offense to anyone else. I wouldn't have had a problem with anybody else replacing anybody I else. I would have. Oh, yeah? Diabetti. Betty. No, the, actually, the only... Well, Diabetti Betty for me, it's like, I, I don't... But I have to respect what she does. And she, yeah. does she does a really good job. She looked great. Yeah. I thought she did a solid job. Yeah. I just didn't want to go through. And Jiria, I didn't think, like, if I was if I was going to yeah. cut someone over for the finale. But I love Angie. Yeah. I didn't love Angie. Yeah. But I thought that she'd kind of shown us all yeah. she was going to show us. I just thought they brought Angie through to the finale because she was such a fan favorite. Yeah. Like, well, as, as, like, no like mad, she wasn't just... winning anyway. It's no skin off our nose yeah. to have another queen performing. Yeah, so she's, she's delightful. But Bless I, her I, heart. I thought she'd shown us all. And Bosco was a she peaked for me. Yeah, there was a moment for me where I was like, "Okay, what else have you got?" With me? You know, no offense, but what else have you got? Yeah, because that after the because Diabetti did the exact opposite. She was she crashed and then and then Ooh. and then just before catwalk, whatever the challenge was before the catwalk, the catwalk won. Like she just seemed to kind of, I think once Jasmine left, she just kind of knuckled down and was allowed herself to be a drag queen. Well, yeah. She wasn't so distracted by bullying. So yeah, it was yeah. Very hard. distracting to bully people. Yeah, <laughs> takes a, a lot, lot out of you. A lot of energy. I'm exhausted. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can't live with the knees either. It just happens. And so, <laughs> Rue spun the big wheel. Uh, she said, "Well, it was her choice anyway." So, spinning a yeah, wheel or not, she knew who was going through, and it was Lady Camden and Will Pill. Will Pill. And so, while they were getting ready that they did uh, in the course of the show was they highlighted Drag Race Live the show in Vegas uh, by showing the cast which was made up of Michaels Cameron Michaels there. Derek Barry Naomi Small look fantastic mm. um, there was a bevy of queens and then the cast of season 14 got tucked in uh, for that number they also did one of the best things I have ever seen because Ruse noted this queen out before she's been in the audience before and Roos pointed her out a couple of times, or at least once that I remember. And it was hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. And she is a queen that has been around. She was in the movie Miss Congeniality, too, because they had the whole Tina Turner competition, and she was one of the queens in it. And um, I just thought it was so lovely that they paid uh, homage, tribute to her, and that she was there for that. Oh, she was very, clearly so touched. Yeah, her. she was very touched, because they didn't have to. There was no reason. I think it's great. I mean, you're yeah. in Vegas. She's a Vegas queen. Yeah. Known to be a Vegas yeah. queen. But she's oh. also a legend, a legendary queen that's been one of those people that's helped pave the road for queens. I think it's it's good for a certain demographic of drag race yeah. fans who seem to think that drag started 14 years ago on the first episode yeah. of Drag Race. Yeah. I don't 
understand that there's like there's a huge history and there's all these wildly talented queens you've never heard of that have been around forever and a day. Of course, we had to announce Ms. Congeniality, and to do that, they introduced Simone first. Yes, yeah, Simone came out to talk about her oh, brain, her year. My God, the hair, the pants, the pants, the top. Oh my God, she looks so gorgeous. Those, and those the, pants. I want the those best pants. thing about all of her outfits is the look on her face. Like, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah, and you know, and she just. Fantastic. She just she just looks so gorgeous. I love and she brought out La La Rie. La La Rie last season's yes, Miss Congeniality. Yes, yes. And so she announced the cast pick, and this is the thing I like about Miss Congeniality, the cast picks. Yeah, ever since So whether Valentina you like won. whoever yeah. But Miss Congeniality is usually always picked by the people involved because they know the person most. I get to how nice you are through the TV. I have no idea. But uh, it was cornbread. Now, what did you think of it? I thought it was a weird choice. I always think it's strange when you pick a Miss Congeniality who goes home so early. Like, I know it was 20 episodes in because of how long the season was, yeah. but it was still, she was still, like, one of the, like, six, third, She was only there for episode. three episodes. Yeah. yeah. So she wasn't even, usually it's somebody who's just shy of top five or in that top five, you know, like, they, they just missed the finale. It's usually yeah. th- in that area. That's They've strange. been there that long. But unless everyone just really enjoyed the way she started to bully Jasmine yeah. before she left. Well, well this is the thing. If she had stayed months. longer, would she have bullied her more? You know what I mean? Because Daya didn't really start to bully Jasmine until Cornbread left. I think Jasmine must be giving off, like, a pheromone. Need to hate something. Jasmine. Uh, but Get her. I was surprised. I was. I really wanted a, a Carrie Cole. Gary was going to I this. really want yeah. well, especially because she was so lovely at the reunion. I as thought well. Nigeria might have won. Yeah, Nigeria would have been apparently an she's a monster off yeah, camera. Well, she's a bit Who of a knows. What did you think of this lip sync? What did I think of this lip sync? Well, first, I was very excited to hear that the prize money had gone. Wasn't that fantastic? And that there was prize for second place. 150 for first place, and then the. 50 grand for second 50 place. grand? That's yeah. half of what they were getting for winning before. So well, that's we're doing math right in front Plus of you. Plus the two, what was it, the five grand that they got for from... Uh, two grand just for being Two there, grand just for being there. Two grand for this. Yeah, these girls made some yeah, money. Yeah, they, so. they, they were okay. Well, as soon as Rue announced that, all of a sudden I like, relaxed. Yeah. Because I'm like, okay, just like, both these girls are going to win something. Yeah. I can just sit back yeah, yeah. and enjoy. Most of it will go to taxes, thing. but still, good for them. And uh, so, I don't know. I have to say, if I watched this lip sync on a regular season, I would have had a double shot sachet. I was just so not impressed. Really? Yeah, I just was not impressed by this lip sync. The costumes were all right. I really did like Willow's costume off the top, but she's worn things like that before. And, I, and, I, and I'm not saying that in a bad way, but it was like, okay. Yeah, we see the long arms. Yeah, 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 we've seen it. That's I, fine. I, I really like the visual... Willow's costume. I just felt it took a little. It swallowed her up. Took a little too long to get to get anywhere. It's like, okay, you gotta ditch this mask. And then she ditched it. Yeah, Camden looked alright, but she didn't look great. I mean, I'm sitting here right now. I can't even tell you what she had on. She had like the white tunic top. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Big like gold boots. She had that cute little crown. That's right. Yeah, that's right. And uh, with the updo. And then she, uh, Willow, took off the overcoat. She had these overalls that came, or pants that came up to her chin. Which is like one pant leg. It was. It was weird. I I mean, again, where was she in that outfit? For me, anyway. And then Lady Camden whipped off what she had on, uh, revealed a red, long red wig, and uh, a flame onesie, a flamey onesie. And then Willow whipped off her pant, and uh, she had on a purple, dark, flamey onesie. Very, very. They felt very complimentary. To very each other. coordinated for two people who didn't know necessarily that they were going to be lip syncing against and each other. That is the point when the when the lip sync finally took off for me. Yes. They seem to be having a really good time. They seem to be performing together, which yeah. I always love. Yeah. Very generous yeah. as a performer. Yeah. And then yeah. they, they finished the cap it off looking at it in you know a nice coordinated big fashion. So yeah. I was I was entertained. I I enjoyed it. I, th- I just thought it took a little to get going. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, a little yeah. longer than I would have liked. Yeah. yeah. I, I just feel there have been definitely, it wasn't an iconic lip sync, and there have been yeah. better. Yeah. So. There was no flower petals. Yeah. There was no corpses of butterflies. No, there was, no. Yeah, I don't know. It was, it was a very non threatening finale. Yeah. And then it was announced. Good luck, Willow. What is your I was excited. I, I 
love Willow. I love that she almost does her own thing. Yeah. Uh, even if she's not doing necessarily the brief. The better thing or like, whatever. Well, yeah. I'm just going to do this because yeah. I like this. So yeah. I love that. I love seeing what, what Willow has to do. I was going into, going into it. I was on I was on Team Canada. I, I, was, I was Lady C. She, yeah. she captured me as the season went on. So yeah. I was... Like, Willow I loved from the very first episode. Canada snuck off. I was not... Sorry that Willow won. I wasn't well, was at happy. all, but it was. I kind of was like, okay. I don't know. I just, I just, I think that the lip sync itself was just lackluster for me, yeah. and, and and that's the thing that kind of held me back from from really like, yay, you know. It was like, yeah, okay, you have to call somebody. Um, I'm really happy for Willow. I think she's going to be a great representative for. I think she's going to do great things. I, I hope she comes out with a line of fake mustaches. That outfit. I that was loved great. That. that was great. Yeah, her Vegas yeah. walk around was great. Was yeah. too fun. Yeah. yeah. I, I want to see what she's going to do next. I'm going to keep an eye on Lady Camden. I'm going to see what she does Absolutely. next. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm going to see who uh, dies dad's in the back. Yeah. It's going to be it's going to be very exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see what happens. <laughs> well, there you go. That is our review of oh. the RuPaul's Drag Race season 14 finale. Will it be the box friend? Thank you so much for coming. Oh, it looks gorgeous. Thanks, Mama. And, of course, I'd like to thank you all for showing up as well. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up down below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well. And if you know somebody who is as big a Drag Race fan as we all are, don't be afraid to share this video either. There are also links in my description box to be a tipper do. Join the Figure Do family on Patreon. Get yourself some Wilma merch. It's a vast array of options down there. So, you know, bring a storm, that's what I'm saying. And uh, until next time, miss me! Ah! Thank you so much. Oh, that was fun. No, no, please. Don't bring her. Just go. Just go. Just go. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. 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 Gorgeous. They can't help it. By the way, nice nails. Have you seen these nails before? I have, because I made them. Did gloves. you make me these lovely gloves, Mom? They took me forever. Mama. I did them did by they? hand, so they okay. fit better than mine. Right? Really? House of Milan. Ooh. Have you been watching Spain? I have. A, I'm a little behind. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but I've been enjoying it. Big button. And, uh, yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. That's I'm when I pushed it. her down by the face, Your Honor. Right by the face. <laughs> I chipped the tooth. I chipped the tooth. It wasn't my tooth. Grab somebody and they can. Um, yeah, I've been enjoying Spain. I just have to... It's been so hard to watch it with the... the I don't know what it is this year. Either they're talking faster or their subtitling gets slower. But I am getting, like, major eye strain. You've learned some Spanish, girl. Olay. <laughs> <laughs>